Tis the season for peppermint flavored food. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Thank you for making us a part of your daily routine. And as a reward for that, we got a big, big show big, for you. Big, man. It's so big. It's so big. I got some more pics to hopefully get back on the Instagram. Mike and Alex get covered in Sharpies. And we present our twist on the new LaCroix hair color trend. Huh. But first, pumpkin spice, we need to break up. I've decided I want to see other spices. And tis the season for peppermint flavored everything. Mm -hmm. And once again, Trader Joe's has gone overboard. What? So it's time for I got a craverin for some peppermint flavorin. Okay, so we're going to be tasting and ranking various peppermint flavored Trader Joe's items. Now we've got six items. There's a lot they more. They got more than six. So we've narrowed Joe it down to goes six. Cray cray. Uh, we narrowed it down to six that we think are representative of the peppermint offerings. In order to help you make your choice, if you need to narrow it down further than that, um, we've got our our uh, score. Our, what's it called? A scale. A scale, not score. Amazement, enchantment, mint. Tioker. That one was a stretch. Yeah, it was really working until minty ochre. What about mint? Ah, that's good. <laughs> Disappointment and abolishment. Wow, that's don't, harsh. Maybe harsh don't buy words. that one. I don't harsh know. Words. Let's let's uh let's get going with the first one. What do we have here? Some peppermint pretzel. Oh no, peppermint bark. This is peppermint bark. Now let me just let me just start. You don't even have to hear us say this, but just in case you're new. You know that I'm going to like everything because I like everything, <laughs> and Link is going to have a fundamental problem with peppermint because and Link Rhett, has a fundamental problem Rhett with peppermint. Rhett is going to see and with frustration. Go, and, and Rhett is going to be a little bit annoyed by that. <laughs> so let's just go ahead and get that out of the way. Yes, I'm going to be annoyed by the fact that he doesn't like peppermint because I love peppermint. But you know what? And this is one of my favorite things on earth. This I, is my number one. Well, don't go ahead. I'm just telling you, if you can beat you... peppermint bark, I'll give it to you. I never had peppermint bark because I never thought I would like it. I'm gonna set it aside. Somewhere for a in between second. the two of us is an impartiality. But you can't not like everything. We're just the yin. We're the yin and the yang, as we would say as kids who didn't know what yin yang was. Yeah. Good gosh, bark is hard. Yeah. Wouldn't be bark if it wasn't hard. It's got quite a bite too. You hear me? Just promise me. Promise me. Just promise, promise me. me. The, the one thing you if won't. This is it. The one thing you won't say is. It would be good if it were not for the peppermint. Just go, don't say, <laughs> you cannot say that. I was about to say that. No. <laughs> Tell me how to interact with it, because I'm thinking about chocolate and peppermint, but I'm not thinking about them together. Don't think about it, just enjoy it. Just embrace it, man. I would say it's don't not think bad. It. That's the problem, you think about food, I just eat it. I, I would, use my stomach and my mouth, not my brain. Since I don't think it's bad and he thinks everything is great, I'm gonna put it right here in the middle like we normally start, and then I'm not opposed to moving this forward because it's not bad at all. All right. But let's move on. Okay. Now we have the pretzels. No, these are peppermint pretzel slims, our thin, crunchy pretzel slims with a creamy coating and peppermint sprinkles. Now, people out there be eating these by the bag full thinking they're getting skinny because they're called slims. That ain't how it works, y'all. I think it's just that the pretzel is slim. The pretzel is slim. You're not going to be slim if you eat a lot of these. Now, I don't love pretzels either. <laughs> How, how I mean, you? there's so many things to eat. Why do I, why do, I don't have exactly. to like everything. Exactly, it's like the world <laughs> is your oyster. And I, you don't like oysters either. I don't, but I don't, I don't I love mean, oysters. I mean, but. This isn't bad. This isn't bad. I feel like I'm getting in the holiday spirit and I can tell you are. <laughs> They're so, so good, man. The pretzel thing kind of widens it out. Can we put them both at number one for now? No, this is a little better. I think this is a little better. Really, that's, that, that hurts me, man. I've been living off that bark for a long time. <laughs> that, Those are really good, though, especially coming off of the bark, getting into the slims, coming off of the bark, going the sweet to the saucy? Or so, not saucy. But that being it is. said, it's salty. I'm okay. saying we're going, oh, now we're going to mix it up with some beverage. We've got. Um, no, this is green tea, man. Candy cane green tea, decaffeinated. Now, I, I'm a fan of green tea. I've been doing a, a lot of green tea since I stopped drinking coffee because it. Does something to my insides. I don't want to explain what it does. I'll show you some pictures. Follow me on Instagram. Um, I don't take pictures of what I deposit in the toilet. Don't get it. Don't get excited. He has taken some selfies on the toilet. He didn't think no, you no, would no, notice, no, but no, you that did. That was Snapchat. My first ever Snapchat <laughs> selfie was a toilet selfie. Now this is a sweet spot for peppermint for me. I mean, really? on a cane and in a tea. So I'm all about this. This is really good. 
but it doesn't it doesn't excite me. Here's like I yeah I, like, exactly. I, I'd hurt somebody over either of these. You know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> oh, really? If, if this I was the, tell. if this was the last thing on the aisle in Trader Joe's and it was I'm, not even Black Friday, I'm just talking like a regular Tuesday. Right. I might hurt somebody. I mean, I'm a big man. I get excited. I might hurt somebody over this. I'll be like, oh, you can have the green tea. It's I'll, I'll, I'll get some. Well, other. because peppermint tea is something that any time of year I could grab out of a yeah. out of a shelf. So it's not that it's bad, it's just that it's not special enough. Man, boy, talk about that. Now I got two mugs. Okay, now, what we is, keep these what is this? in supply at my house. Really? We keep all, we got all this. <laughs> we have a peppermint shelf. <laughs> the shelf itself is made of peppermint. This time of year, or you, you stock right, up? Yeah, it, it's this time of year. Uh, but me and the kids, we really like these minty mallows. I just don't. You don't like marshmallows either, do you? I don't love marshmallows. <laughs> I, well, hold I, on. I'm, I, not, I'm, I'm not proud of it. I'm beginning to think. I'm not you, proud like, of it. You, at some point, you set out and you just decided <laughs> to hate things, man. Is it because I, I love everything and you feel like you have to hate things just I, to balance us? I, I recognize that. I knew, I know there were people on my side. You may have been on my side at the beginning of this conversation, and now I'm losing you. And you've not liked everything so far. I know it's a problem. And, and, and but you, you know what? We haven't I'm even trying gotten to the peppermint. We're just talking about the other things associated with the <laughs> I'm peppermint. I'm trying to maybe the peppermint will help mm -hmm. me like I don't hate marshmallows, it's just that it's not what I choose when there's other things on the shelf like peanut butter or just chocolate. I love or white the, chocolate, which is really the chocolate. texture, the love the texture of a marshmallow, but I got to say mm. in the context but these other things, it's not as good as I remember it. It's not as good as the Slims or the Bark. I mean, right off the bat, it tastes a little toothpastey. You're right, it's very strong. It's aromatic, and um, it's not as good to I'm me not gonna either. take them off the shelf, the peppermint shelf, they will stay on. You're gonna, put, you're gonna put it low, low, low? Let's put it low, low, low. Really? No, I feel bad about that. All right, next one. We can switch it in a little bit. Now we've got some Candy Cane JoJo's. Now they look like Oreos, they're not Oreos. I love Oreos. Is that a joke? Yeah. You don't like Oreos? I don't hate Oreos, but if there's a, like another type of cookie there, I'm probably gonna choose it. <laughs> and I'm sorry. I'm legitimately sorry that I'm being this way. You cannot say that it's not a little annoying. I know you people I know, in the I comments. Know. You, 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 you're like, well, I don't like things too. We know you don't like things. You made that very clear. <laughs> now, but. <laughs> it's a little annoying when somebody doesn't like everything, right? I mean, just come on. Maybe I'm a little annoying being annoyed by it. I understand that too, but I mean, come on, give me a break. Yeah. Let me say this. Nothing that I've eaten is bad. It has been bad. <laughs> okay. You know, I've been talking about preference. After eating the other peppermint stuff, I think that marshmallow, especially, I cannot really taste the peppermint in this. This is a very slight peppermint. It's mild. It kind of tastes like somebody stuck something into some Oreos, though. Like Which is it, good. No, in a bad way. Oh, like in a bad Oreos way? Oreos and somebody put some, like, borax in them. Like, they're trying to kill the roaches. Borax and, is not peppermint -y. No, I tried it. I like that. It's but, really good. But it's, cr it's, like, crystallized and crunchy. It is a crunchiness. I could take it or leave it. I'm not going to hurt anybody over this. You know I what like, I'm saying? I like the mild peppermininess of it. It's better I'm than saying, the tea. It's better than the tea. It's I'm not better than the bark. It should go in there. Okay, and final. Give me something else, guys. Oh, finally, some, what is this, chocolate milk? Chocolate peppermint almond beverage. Ooh, not, Boy, that I sounds appetizing. You know what I love? Almond Cho beverage. Chocolate milk. Oh. <laughs> so. It's not chocolate milk, it's almond beverage. They couldn't even say almond milk. You know the milk people have been really upset about people saying almond milk? Because it's not The milk, milk lobby is like, it? listen, you can squeeze a nut all you want, you ain't gonna get no milk out of it. Speak They're for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> they are really upset about it. They got to Joe. Joe caved and said almond beverage. You gotta come up with something better. Almond juice, at least say that. Beverage doesn't Almond sound. juice. <laughs> almond juice. <laughs> Chocolate almond juice. Chocolate almond juice. <laughs> Dink it and keep drinking it. You like it? Uh, I cannot taste the peppermint after the other stuff. We need a peppermint palate cleanser. Uh, typically for an almond juice, it's kind of thin, but this is a thickness that it is pretty brings, nice, me, brings me to the farm. What's happening on the farm? Oh, the yard. Not the farm. Yeah, yeah. The milkshake yeah. brings the kids to the farm. That's what I thought the lyric was. Yeah. Uh, I think you're talking about a field trip. Okay. Um, it's it's fine. Again, it, it's just okay. I can take it or leave it. Like if you if, if if you gave me this, I wouldn't be insulted, but I wouldn't. I'd be like, oh, okay. It's is I don't, it better than the tea. I don't think it's better than the tea. It's not better than the tea. It's not better than the tea. It's not better than the mallows. Oh, you're going low, low, low. Yeah. Come on, beverage. Man. Give me, give it's me. not even in the yard. All right, what do you think about this? I know you want to put the bark 
at number one. But I don't know. I feel I the, the slims were really good and they and they help you lose weight. So <laughs> you know, there's a lot there's a lot to love about them. Uh, I am in total agreement, and I think that you know what this has opened up a world of peppermint and pretzel for me. And you know what, I'm a new man. I'm never gonna bad mouth um, peppermint stuff again. I don't believe you. Uh, well, I'm gonna try, and I do want to apologize one more time. But you should probably apologize too. I'm sorry, Link. For what? I don't know. <laughs> Flip through to see what happens when you like stand in the middle of Hollywood Boulevard and ask strangers to tattoo you, with, tattoo you with a Sharpie. Pop the corn, sit back, and relax because the new season of Buddy System is available to watch right now on YouTube Red.